where we are right now is we have uh, one more day of phase one split squad. So that's today. Tomorrow the players are off. And then Sunday we'll have three more days of phase one and we will be full squad. Uh, so we'll be full squad starting uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. And then as it progresses, you get into phase two. You have what essentially amounts to an OTA. You take a day off, and it's starting to look more and more like training camp. So I think the coaches and players have done a really nice job to date, getting a lot of good work done on the practice field, which is incredible to be out there on a practice field with real live football players. Uh, just watching our coaches coach has been awesome for me. Just bouncing around the different positions and listening to them teach. Uh, has been very, very impressive. So the guys are really attacking this portion of training camp, doing a great job in the weight room, the conditioning part of this. So we just got to keep it going. Uh, we'll also, we'll, we've been virtual on all of our meetings. Starting Sunday, we will do meetings in person in the morning, and then we'll do uh, virtual at night. So again, there's a progression to all of this, and, and we're just going to keep talking about it, keep thinking about what makes sense uh, as we continue to be ready to pivot at a moment's notice. What is obvious to me is that guys worked very hard in this offseason, both physically and mentally. I, I'm, I think watching the uh, walkthroughs, watching the coaches interact with the players, there's, there is a good understanding of what we want to do. Now, I'll steal a line. I talked to Coach Kubiak the other night, and, and he said it, and it's right. The, the teaching is ahead of the doing right now. So we had a really good offseason of, of teaching. Uh, we've had a ton of meetings to, to this point and now with these walkthroughs we're finally doing so just to see the guys walk through techniques and I mean literally walk through you know we're having a, a period where these guys are not moving very fast but they're getting the, the body to get through the football movements uh, is, is really important so I've just been impressed with what the guys have been able to retain going back to the spring and then like we talked about the guys attacked the offseason in the weight room and, and showed up in really good shape so I've really enjoyed truly getting around to the different positions and, and watching the coaches coach, uh, watching them teach, and the guys are absorbing. And we have to just be so efficient in our days, uh, try not to waste a day, try not to waste a period here out of practice. So the guys have been uh, very engaged.